Okay, um, this is Austin awesome, Trouble 88. This is my first YouTube video ever. I'm very excited about making it. And the subject I will be talking about is Naruto and parents. Everyone knows back in, I think it was 07, 08, when Cartoon Network showed the original ep or Naruto episode 140. The episode when the fake Kabuto pulled out his heart. Well, as soon as that episode was aired, where I heard over 2,000 dumbass parents called in the Cartoon Network, Turtle, Turtle Broadcast, or whatever, who owns them now, and said that their kids had a nightmare from that episode. And now the dumb question I want to ask those parents who called in and say, hey, my kids had a nightmare from this one episode of Naruto was, why in hell you let your kids stay up that late to watch an anime that you know is going to be graphic? Come on, man. Are you that dumb? Everyone knows that Naruto is rated PG-13. And on the DVD, it is actually TV-14. The manga, which I read myself, is also rated for teens. And yet, these crazy parents are letting their kids, 8 to 12, watch this anime knowing their kids are going to have bad dreams or interpret stuff on the show. Now, a long time ago, there was a story about a kid who buried himself in sand, imitating Gara of the desert when he was burying Rockley in the sand during their fight in the tuning exam. Well, the parents never told the kids not to try the stuff in the show. And yet, Cartoon Network, the people who showed that episode, got the black backlashing from them. Parents today are not thinking right, okay? When it comes to anime, that's when the parents are worse at making decisions. When I was a kid, my mom and dad never, not me, never, let me watch an anime that was TV-14. Why? Because they know it's going to be graphic, inappropriate, and violent. Now, these parents today who are letting the kids watch Naruto, when they know it's going to be all this nasty stuff in it, are saying, oh, my kid ain't gonna do anything like this. Oh, then please tell me why did a boy bury himself in sand and die? Where were the parents at? Now, we already know that Naruto is one of the best anime next to Dragon Ball Z. When Cartoon Network showed Dragon Ball Z for one whole month period, parents didn't even give a damn. They let their kids watch it. Now I was about 14 when they did that, so I was allowed to watch it. But as soon as they showed that one whole season, uncut, unedited, what did the parents do? Went off on Cartoon Network, of course. My kid did this, my kid did that. Why the hell you show this anime uncut for? They give you a warning, people. Do you know what a warning is? Look it up on Google. It knows everything. And here I am thinking that Disney's got Naruto Shippuden out. And they're just going to rape edit it. They're going to rape edit it. First episode that my mom made me watch on Disney Channel. On Disney XD, yeah, I forgot. They edited out the sexy jutsu and made it the cutie jutsu. I got the first episode uncut on DVD. I know the editing difference. The hottie jutsu? Really? Disney, can you come up with something better? And everyone knows that Cartoon Network could do a better job than that. They never edited out the sexy jutsu or the pervy jutsu. So, what was Disney thinking getting Naruto Shippuden for these kids to watch? It's going to be like the guard incident and the kid who buried himself in sand all over again. And everyone could see that coming right at the bat. I was talking to a good friend of mine who is a very good anime expert. And he told me that Disney did me a wrong move buying Naruto Shippuden. Because when they get to Sasuke versus Itachi fight, he estimated it's going to be like 10 minutes of the anime. Because there's going to be so much editing done. 
the eye gouging and stuff is going to be added. Sasuke and the Genjutsu when his eyes are getting pulled out is going to be editing. There's going to be a lot of editing in that arc. I can see it already. I read the manga of that storyline. I watched some of the sub episodes of that story arc. And I will tell you. Parents are going to let their kids watch this. And the kids are going to interpret this stuff like that in the real, in the real world. Saying, hey, I'm going to gosh out my best friend's eyeball so I can have better eyes. Well, America parents has failed once again. Now, in Japan, their parents actually got brains. Heck, they're the third most pe peaceful country in the world right now. Better than the U.S., which we were ranked 86. So, parents in Naruto don't mix too well. Because the parents are going to let the kids watch Naruto. The kids are going to do stuff in the show. And then the parents are going to put the blame on Cartoon Network. But now, Disney's going to get the blame for it because they got it now. Because Cartoon Network doesn't got the rights to it anymore. They don't got the airing rights to it. Because I told my dad how Disney got Naruto. He said, oh, they own the editing rights. They own the dubbing rights to it. It's like, no. Airing rights. I mean, so you can show it on TV. Biz got the dubbing rights to it. See how parents see, see how parents are really dumb. But, but my advice, if you're a parent out there and you're watching this video thinking, hey, I want my kids to watch this. Think about it. Go online. Go to Wikipedia and type in Naruto Shippuden. It will give you all the information about the anime. If you want your kids to walk get into anime and stuff, do some research. Use your head. Think about how your kids are going to react about the anime. Think how they're going to act it out and playing games and stuff. Because Naruto isn't for little kids. It is for teenagers and adults. And if some parents can't get that through their heads, and then we got an issue. We really got an issue right there. Because Naruto is for the kids. Isn't for kids, as I say. It is for teens and adults. If they can't, parents can't understand that fact, and then they shouldn't really be parents at all. No offense to anyone out there who are who got kids of their own and stuff. But but Disney and Naruto is gonna be an epic fail. Some of us true anime fans of that had already seen it coming. Because last week Cartoon Network I says a Disney X why can I keep getting the two mixed up? Didn't show up to one oh one. It didn't get released on iTunes. But I found out this week that eight box set